Step back into the enchanting era of 1960 with the heartwarming film Pollyanna. This cinematic gem remains a timeless emblem of the industry, cherished for its enduring qualities. Its narrative threads together a tale of optimism and resilience, a theme that continues to resonate with audiences across generations. The movie follows the journey of Pollyanna, a spirited young girl whose unwavering positivity transforms the lives of those around her. Through its portrayal of hope in the face of adversity, Pollyanna leaves an indelible mark, drawing viewers into its world of charm and optimism. What enduring qualities do you think make this movie an everlasting symbol of the industry? Do you have a cherished memory associated with this film? Share your stories and experiences in the comments below. I'd love to hear them. Now, here's an interesting fact about the movie. Did you know that Pollyanna was based on the best-selling novel by Eleanor H. Porter, originally published in 1913? This classic story's adaptation to the silver screen captivated audiences, bringing Pollyanna's tale of hope and positivity to life in a vivid and heartfelt manner. Share your cherished memories and personal experiences related to this movie in the comments below. We're eager to hear your stories and reflections. Writer and director David Swift faced a tough task finding the right actor for the lead in the 1960 movie Pollyanna. After scouting through 362 girls, no one fit the role. However, fate intervened when producer Walt Disney's wife and studio head Bill Anderson's wife spotted Haley Mills in the film Tiger Bay while shopping in London. They persisted until the men agreed to watch the movie, and upon doing so, Haley was immediately chosen to play Pollyanna. Kevin Corcoran, who portrayed Jimmy Bean, also lent his voice to a storybook recording that accompanied the film, featuring songs dropped from the movie. This behind-the-scenes story sheds light on the casting challenges and the fortuitous discovery that led to the iconic portrayal of Pollyanna in the film. The directorial debut of David Swift, 1960's Pollyanna, marked the beginning of a fruitful collaboration between him and Haley Mills. This film was the first of six that Mills made during her contract with Walt Disney Studios. Swift's direction set the stage for his subsequent work with Mills in The Parent Trap the following year. Additionally, the movie featured the iconic number 94 locomotive, which remains on display at the Western Railway Museum in Northern California. These elements contribute to the legacy and impact of Pollyanna, showcasing both Swift's directorial debut and the start of Haley Mills' significant career with Disney. In the making of the 1960 movie Pollyanna, director David Swift chose the town of Harrington as a key setting. Interestingly, he revealed in the commentary that the townsfolk in many scenes were actually the citizens of Santa Rosa, California. Dressed in period costumes, they enthusiastically participated in crowd scenes, notably during the dramatic climax when the entire population of Harrington gathered to bid farewell to Pollyanna at the train station. This behind-the-scenes tidbit not only adds a touch of local authenticity to the film, but also showcases the unique collaboration between professional actors and the community of Santa Rosa contributing to the movie's memorable scenes and overall charm. The 1960 film Pollyanna faced challenges at the box office, and Walt Disney attributed its underwhelming performance to the choice of title. According to Disney, the movie might have fared better with a different name, as he believed the sweet and sticky connotation deterred men from watching. Despite this, the film marked the final theatrical appearance of Adolf Menju, who portrayed Mr. Pendergast. Interestingly, the orphanage house featured in Pollyanna still exists, on the Warner Brothers backlot and shares space with the house used in Elvira, Mistress of the Dark. The enduring presence of this movie set adds a unique dimension to the legacy of Pollyanna. In hindsight, the clash between the perceived sweetness of the title and the movie's actual content provides an intriguing insight into the dynamics of audience expectations. The film's enduring elements, such as the iconic orphanage set and Adolf Menge's final performance, contribute to the layered history of Pollyanna, transcending initial box office outcomes. Walt Disney's quest for the perfect lead actress in the 1960 film Pollyanna led to an unexpected discovery. While shopping in London, the wives of producer Walt Disney and studio head Bill Anderson spotted Haley Mills in the film Tiger Bay. Despite initial reluctance from the men, a viewing of the movie resulted in Haley Mills being immediately chosen for the iconic role. 
This chance encounter marked the beginning of a successful collaboration between Mills and director David Swift, setting the stage for a series of films under Mills' contract with Walt Disney Studios. A unique behind-the-scenes tidbit doesn't end there. The town of Harrington, a key setting in the movie, was not what it seemed. Director David Swift revealed that many townsfolk in scenes were actually citizens of Santa Rosa, California, dressed in period costumes. This collaboration between professional actors and the local community added a touch of authenticity to the film, notably during the dramatic climax at the train station, where the entire population of Harrington bid farewell to Pollyanna. Despite the challenges at the box office and Walt Disney's belief that the title may have deterred some viewers, the film has left lasting impressions. Adolf Menge's final theatrical appearance as Mr. Pendergast and the enduring presence of the Pollyanna movie set on the Warner Brothers backlot contribute to its layered history. The clash between the perceived sweetness of the title and the film's content provides intriguing insight into audience dynamics. The legacy of Pollyanna transcends initial box office outcomes, encompassing the unexpected discoveries and collaborative efforts that shaped its making. Speaking of unexpected discoveries, the opening scene of the movie is marked by a close-up of a young boy, played by William Betts, swinging from a rope and jumping into a river. The picturesque Vermont town depicted in the film was, in fact, a blend of various locales in Napa Valley and Sonoma County, California. Betts, who wasn't an actor but happened to live where the movie was filmed, shared that people weren't allowed to swim in the river, adding a layer of irony to the scene. Before the movie even began production, Walt Disney took Haley Mills and her family to Disneyland and later invited them to his home for dinner. A humorous moment ensued when Lillian Disney, Walt's wife, asked Haley if she was looking forward to the film. Haley's response, what film? In summary, the 1960 movie Pollyanna is not just a cinematic gem, but a product of serendipitous encounters, unexpected collaborations, and moments of joy that define its enduring legacy in film history. As the cinematic tapestry of the 1960 film Pollyanna unfurls before you, it weaves a narrative that transcends the boundaries of time and space. A tale not just confined to the flickering frames, but one that resonates within the chambers of your own experiences. Pollyanna, with its enchanting innocence and enduring optimism, serves as a mirror reflecting the hues of your own memories. As you bid adieu to this celluloid journey, take a moment to ponder the threads that tie you to this classic gem. What echoes of your life resonate in the corridors of Harrington and the denizens of Harrington? Did Pollyanna's infectious positivity spark a flame within you, igniting your own reservoirs of hope and resilience? Or perhaps you found solace in the quaint charm of Harrington as a surrogate for your own cherished locales. This isn't just a movie, it's a portal to introspection. So, I invite you to share your reflections. What moments from Pollyanna linger in your thoughts? What emotions does the mere mention of the film evoke within you? Your narrative weaves into the rich tapestry of those who have experienced the magic of Pollyanna, creating a collective story that stretches beyond the confines of the screen. In the vast expanse of cinematic history, Pollyanna stands as a testament to the enduring power of optimism. As you navigate the labyrinth of your own memories, let Pollyanna be a guiding light, illuminating the corners of your soul where nostalgia resides. Thank you for embarking on this journey through time and celluloid with me. Your thoughts and memories are the brushstrokes that color the canvas of our shared appreciation for this timeless classic. Until our paths cross again in the realms of reflection and recollection, may your days be as radiant as the spirit of Pollyanna herself.